We are at the Suzuki Circuit in Japan for the first race of the SCRL Valvoline Rally Car Series Season 1. Yeah, we got a new series. And, yeah. The 29 of Morgan McPherson will be leading us to the green flag storm beside him will be the 21 of Troy McClure. We have 25 uh, drivers in this race. Normally we was going to have 26, but since this track can only fit 20, uh, you know, five cars in here, I took myself out so everybody else could race. Normally we was going to have, you know, rally tracks, since this is a rally car mod. Unfortunately, afford, damn it, unfortunately, a lot of the rally car tracks are broken, and you can't really race them, and you can't download them, so... I had to come up with substitute tracks. And here's the command. Drivers, start your engines! This will be a 15 race schedule for season one. I have never used this car mod before. So, uh oh. We got a car stalled. Who was that? That's the 24 of Noah Cars. I don't... Uh, is his car past... Oh, his car is not past the start-finish line, so... I don't know if he's going to get points or not. Of course, this is the track that the NASCAR... Whoa! There's a green flag. And... 29 gets a great jump. This is the track that the NASCAR Winston Cup Series ran at 96 at the end of the season. And we get the green. Oh, I thought I saw we go. Oh. oh my god. Whoa, holy sh Well, there's three four cars out. And there's another one spinning. Whoa, one, two, three, four, five. I got five cars on pit road now. And the caution is out on the very first lap. No surprise there. And a 29 will lead him across the line. Uh, this is going to be a... Probably a bad race. Morgan McPherson in the 29 car is your race leader. We'll take a look at the first caution of the day. So what caused the caution? Jesse Turner clips Troy McClure. And there they go. The 72 got involved. So did, uh, who is that? 34? Yes, 34. Some cars go through the grass. And the 34 comes back across the track, hits that car. And the 21 of Troy McClure hard into the outside wall. And then the 92 goes into the grass. I mean gravel. Then the 50, a big Jake. The 34 of Sir Jamie, which I think that's a Game of Thrones name, right? Oh. And Zachary Fitzwater goes for a little spin. That's all right. And the 72 of Umbreon also spun off the track. Yeah, this track is awesome, but when you have the strength all the way up, a lot of cars are going to be spinning out and whatnot, so I'm not sure we're going to have a green flag finish, but it's exciting. We got Ricks, finally. Restart time. Oh, and we just made it back. 34, 2, 21, and 50 are all out of the race. Morgan McPherson leads him into turn one. Oh, he goes wide. And goodbye. Leader is wrecked. New leader, 75 of Colin Dryberg. And the caution is out, of course, for our leader wrecking. Oh, we got another car spinning off the track. And another car. The 92, Richard Torres. And the 33 of Phil Ship. Colin Dryberg is your new race leader. 
leads them down the front stretch and will lead them to the caution flag. There it is. Yeah, I gotta make sure my replays are not that long because we barely made it back. 75, Colin Jabberg is your race leader. We'll take a look at the second caution of the day. Things went from bad to to worse for Morgan McPherson. Was on the pole. Goes into turn one. Just goes a little bit wide. And into the gravel trap. Loses control. And the 29 goes hard into the outside wall. And more than likely his day is done. Now... We go to the 33 of Phil Ships. I think that's how you say your name. He's already a little wide right there. Then comes back across the track. Into the outside wall. Hard impact by the 33 car. And his day is done as well. And here comes the 92. Richard Torres. Little impact. So he should be able to keep on going. We're probably not going to have a green flag lap. Unless we have one car left. Restart time. And we are back. More cars out of the race. There's a green flag. Driver leads into the green. Here comes the 25 of Matt Johnson. Wants that race lead. Heading into turn one. No. Matt Johnson takes the lead. Oh, there goes Dryberg. Oh, the leader's red. Dryberg keeps the race lead. Drivers are sliding off the track. Oh, Dryberg got taken out. Oh, oh my, holy shit. Jay Barker is your race leader now. He survived the wrecks. He's got to keep it on track. He might be in the Katberg seat if this ends the race, which I don't think it will. Jay Barker slowly making his way around the final turn. And Jay Barker will lead him to the caution flag. But will not... I don't think that ended the race. Wow, that was crazy. Jay Barker is your race leader. So here's what happened. Alex Hawkins goes to the inside of Dryberg. Clips Dryberg and Dryberg comes back across the track. And Matt Johnson... The front three leaders, well, 25, got wrecked, and Alex Hawkins did too. So, Dryberg survived up to this point. <coughs> Cars going through the grass. Alex Hawkins comes back across. Wait, that is Alex Hawkins, right? Wait, no, that's Chris Kyle. Chris Kyle comes back across the track and takes out Colin Dryberg. Oh, wow. Driver's going to be mad at Hawkins and Chris Kyle. The 98 hard hit back there. So did Dryberg. Whoa. Whoa, we got more 91. Brian Fox, the 25. Matt Johnson. Battling for the lead. Matt Johnson comes back across the track and gets flipped and rolls. Wow. And turn, what, five and six are a junkyard. And unfortunately, that ended the race. Take it to your results now. I hate it when Brandy Cam messes up. Uh, the race did end under caution, so... Jay Barker scored the win. Second is Kekka White Lion. Third, Grayson Ace Fidu. Fourth is Sebastian Torres. Fifth is Zachary Fitzwater. Sixth was Jesse Turner, who survived. Seventh is Umbreon. Eighth, Brian Fox. Ninth, Richard Torres. And tenth is Chris Kyle. Eleventh was Gabriel Wonderly. Twelfth, Alex Hawkins. Thirteenth, Matt Johnson. Fourteenth, Noah Cars was the last driver to finish the race, but was a lap down. Fifteenth was Mike Pearson. Sixteenth, Colin Dryberg, who led all those laps, but got wrecked out. Seventeenth, New Newley. Eighteenth, Keenan Bush. 19th, Morgan McPherson. 20th, Phil Ships. 
21st is Ding Drinker. 22nd was Sir Jamie. 23rd, John Ard. 24th, Troy McClure. And 25th, last place, Big Jake. And here are your points standings after the first race at Suzuki. Jay Barker has a 7-point lead over Keka White Lion. And you will notice that only the first 10 drivers received points. That's because the Rally Car Championship point standings only awards the first 10 drivers you know, who finish get points. So if you finish 11th to 26th, you will not get points. So this will make things very interesting. So we will see you at the second race of the season at some random track.